snip snip babies whoops gonna see if they're getting yeah, rid of this scooter Brock, Brock wants this. yeah you're getting it Yeah, I have his number. number. I gotta call him to make sure he wants it first. <laughs> Hi everyone, it's Lauren. Thanks so much for joining me for today's video. I am a full-time reseller on Poshmark Canada and you can find my social media linked down below and my username is thriftgoddess on Poshmark and Instagram. And for today's video, I'm going to be taking you on a drive around my neighborhood because it is large article pickup day. See, everyone has... Wow, that is not focusing. Well, you can see that everyone has stuff out over there. So I'm going to be going around, seeing if there's anything worth salvaging, stuff that I can upcycle, repurpose, and do some DIY projects with, or just stuff I can use around the house, or I might even see if there's stuff that I can donate to a local thrift store. So let's take a drive. So I pulled over to look at this peacock chair because I wanted it, but it actually has quite a bit of damage to the bottom, so I'm going to pass. Yeah, that peacock chair would have been really nice, so I'm kind of sad that that didn't work out, but let's see if there's any other goodies I can find. So I, I have three camera batteries, and I somehow managed to end up with all of them dead. So I filmed the first part of this video on my camera, but the rest is going to be on my phone. See, a lot of people are out collecting stuff, like people come out with their trailers, like they go pay them for this. I know a lot of people actually collect scrap metal too which is smart because you can get like quite a bit of money for stuff that people are just throwing out. So here's this pile here. I'm going to see if there's anything worth salvaging. There's some books. There's a lunch pail. This is a bag. I might actually be able to sell that on Poshmark, so I'm going to grab that. Some nail polishes. Backpack, broken toe. All kinds of stuff. Like, you never know what you're gonna find. This is actually clothes, so I might take a look in there in a sec. Um, they're vans. So these I might actually grab and see if I can just clean them up. I'm gonna throw those in this bag. What's that? Polaroid. So here's some puzzles. You never know. You never know. So I'm gonna just get that. actually been looking for one of these. Okay, I sh at the start of the video I should have mentioned a few things that I am looking for. So one thing is a file folder for all like my taxes stuff. And this one is so cute. Like it's it's wicker on the outside and it's got the dividers. That's perfect. Another thing that I'm looking for is any more shelves that I can use for my cardboard boxes in the basement. Because those would be great for organizing. People are probably driving by and be like, what is this chick doing? I can't even, I should have grabbed my other bag from the car, so I'm going to go put this back and then I'm going to come back here. Okay. So much to go through. Sometimes I wonder, like, are these people standing in their house, like, watching me from their front window? I have no idea. I really don't care because, like, they threw it out. They're getting good at it. It's kind of cute. Got dents in it, but maybe I'll think about that. Oh, what? This is a purse. Yeah, like people, s mostly it's large article stuff, but I find people throwing out like a lot of clothing and stuff too. This is like a briefcase. That's actually in really good condition. So I'm gonna take that. This is a little tote bag. Gonna grab that too. Yeah, anything that I might be able to flip for a good. <laughs> Anyone want to do karaoke? Anything that I can flip, you know, people are just getting rid of it. I actually came out um, last night with my boyfriend. We looked through some stuff, and we did end up finding some stuff for the house. So, this is shearing. Yeah, this is just a bag of clothing. that I'm really interested in. 
pirate shirt. It's hard to do this with like one hand too while I'm trying to film, so just bear with me. Yeah, no, so that's all gonna, I'm just gonna leave all the clothes. I think I have quite a bit right now. Um, it's past. There's some more clothes. It looks like little boy stuff. Bags. More puzzles. It's hard with puzzles because you don't know if they're missing anything. junk pretty much. Not seeing too much in there. Trying not to make a mess of this, but if I do, I'm gonna be putting everything back. What are these? Soya concept. This is oh it's a blouse. Okay, I'm gonna take that. Yeah, I'm actually gonna go grab my bag this time because I said I was going to when I first came, but I actually did not end up doing that. So I've got these, KBRB. For a third trip. And the good thing about this is that if I don't sell the stuff, I can just redonate it rather than it being thrown out in the garbage, which all this stuff is going to be thrown out. So. Okay, so I've got some I'm not looking too hard at the stuff right now, so I might find some damage later. another blows. Okay, this is really cute. This is like a tribal sweater dress thing. Grab that. Totally hear someone coughing inside, so there's definitely someone home, but I don't care. Not expecting to find brand names or anything, but just like basic things. This is cute. It's a little ombre maxi skirt. Didn't even see this, but look at this. This is gorgeous. So this is like a wicker tote bag and it's got flowers and a dragonfly on it. Super cute. Okay, so that was just my first stop and surprisingly they had a lot of clothing and stuff that I can sell on Poshmark. I'm just so like baffled by the things that people just get rid of and throw out, you know? Like, what a wasteful world we live in. That's why I'm here. I like to save things from being thrown out. Alright, next stop. Here we go. Well, my car just informed me that I didn't close my trunk properly. Whoops. See, I just drive by slow sometimes because sometimes I can already tell that there's stops that I'm not gonna look at. Like a lot of this stuff is just big furniture, not stuff that I'm in the market for right now. Okay, I just pulled over to this house because I saw a box of shoes and I'm pretty sure I saw a pair of Bergen stocks on top. So we're gonna go see. Please be Bergs. Oh yeah, I also need to fix my trunk because I've been driving around with it open. Okay, so this is what I saw. No way. They are freaking Birkenstocks. Okay. So taking those because they can easily be washed up. I'm gonna grab my bag actually. <gasps> Ugg boots? Dude. Oh. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Oh, it looks like there's clothes too. I'm gonna look through. Nice. People are hilarious. Thank you for throwing this out. <gasps> Sperry's? Like who, who does this? I don't know, but thank you. Rich people. What are these? Anything worth it. Probably just take, you know what, I'm just gonna take the whole box and then whatever I don't take, I'm gonna donate it. Cause this is ridiculous to be just thrown out in the garbage. You know? Cause I'm a good person. Alright, so 
we're gonna see what the fuss is in here. So this is a coat, winter coat, it's a Walmart coat. I'm gonna take that and donate that too, actually. That one's a bit dirty, so I'm gonna leave that one. Bag of books. These are, don't know what that is, but there's a box over here I'm gonna grab. Oh, well that's just trash. What box, you know, shipping box. And I got some shipping boxes too. So that was another good stop, and this is a side of town that I haven't been on before, so I'm actually really glad I came down this way. Now I'm seeing another huge pile up ahead, so I'm gonna go drive there and check it out. So this is what I saw from down the street. Doesn't look like much, really. Same with this one. Just more furniture and whatnot, so I'm gonna pass on those piles. So I just pulled up to this place here, and I see they have a big box of clothes, so I'm gonna go check it out. It looks pretty like ratty stuff and it had a smell to it so I was not gonna go digging through that but yeah nothing really here. I actually drove past here yesterday with Jesse because we were like looking at those chairs we we're like should we but then we didn't and so I pulled over here where the chairs are actually because I see a box of clothes now that I didn't see before. Take a gander. baby clothes so I'm gonna pass on that now. Well that's a new one there's a bag of dog food out here. Gross. Wow just seeing all the stuff that people are just so willing to throw out and not even make an effort to like donate to a thrift store or a post online like Facebook marketplace or Kijiji. It's just sad you know because like all this stuff it just goes to the dump and it just sits there and takes forever to break down. Like, yeah, I totally get it. There's a lot of stuff that can't be donated, but it's just, it's just sad to see, you know? All right, I'm stopped because I saw another bag of what looks like boots. So there is one pair of shoes in here. Some booties, not nurses. You know what? Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. I'm gonna need a pet dryer. Okay, I saw this and I had to like turn around and photograph it because like it's so cute. Like look at this, it's like a velvet couch. And it's like brown with flowers on it. Um, anything here? Not really. If those bins had lids, maybe. But then there's this one too. See, some people have so much stuff, it's like, did you just move in here? Or... <laughs> See, sometimes I forget to check if there's like a car behind me before I'm stopping to look at stuff. So I'm just waiting for the time that there is and someone's just gonna horn blast me. Like, leave me alone. I'm just trying to look at people's trash. I'm gonna check out this pile here. So right away I see some shoes. They are in like decent condition, aside from some scuffs on the toes. But these ones are not, but might grab those. Got some teacups. It's actually really pretty. Okay, I'm gonna tell you guys a really depressing story about these teacups. So I picked them both up and then about a week later I decided to look up comps on them. And the black lace one that I'm holding in my hand right now, it and the saucer are selling on eBay and other sites for like crazy amount of money. Here, I'll, I'll post some comps up here so you can see. And then I realized I only picked up the teacup, so I'm like, crap, I should have picked up the saucer, which you can see right there in the photo, but I didn't grab it. And of course, with my bad luck, the day that I chose to look up the comps on it was the day that they came and took the garbage. But I 
drove back, I actually looked back through my videos, I was able to find out where the house was, miraculously enough, because I spent like three hours driving around, and I went and it was gone, so I was really sad about that, but then I posted on eBay for $100, and I kid you not, not even 10 minutes after I posted it, I got a message from this guy asking if there's any cracks or anything wrong with the cup, and then he sends me an offer for $60, and along with a message saying my offer is because it's only the cup and no saucer and I'm like face palm should have grabbed the saucer but I still got $60 out of it so I can't complain but rookie mistake right there Lauren oh. all around me are familiar faces I was sticking to the thrift store Jesse's gonna be happy about this because I've been meaning to get some of these from like oh, Dollarama. There's one for tomato plants. There's only one and I have two plants, but one's better than none. So I only stopped here for one reason and I think it's a vase and if it's not broken I'm gonna grab it. Oh yeah. What? Look at that. It's like a disco ball. Oh, and there's one inside of it. There's also a bunch of like little, little bowls. So, you know what? I'm just gonna grab them. Can donate them somewhere, a little gravy dish. What else do we got here? Some shelves. These are kind of nice. Mm. Yeah. I'm just gonna grab these. Well, oh, handily enough, I actually have bubble wrap in here so I can wrap these up so they don't break. Okay, so what caught my eye here is this little white pot if it's not broken. And it is not, so I'll grab that. And yeah, everything else. Oh, what's this one? It's a plastic one, but it's so cute. So I'll grab that too. Yeah, two pots. There's a lot of stuff here, so I thought I'd look through here, just in case there's something that catches my eye, but so far I don't see anything. Real broken mirror. Is this closed? Oh, it is closed. Okay, I might come back to that. So. It's more closed here. actually just gonna grab this bag here and then anything I don't take I'll just donate it. So I went through the bag and it ended up being all little girls clothes like really cute pink sequin stuff and there's this beautiful dress and I'm like how does someone just throw this out so I wash it all and I'm gonna put it all in a bundle together. Mm -hmm. Oops. Nothing really interesting here but this little vase thing I'm gonna grab probably try and sell on Poshmark or donate it. See? Really cute. Oh. I pulled over here because I think they have a bunch of picture frames. I hear a dog barking inside, so people are probably going to be looking out the window at me like, Who are you? What are you doing? I think I'm just going to grab this white one here. Nothing else really in here. Some dude in a truck with a trailer on the back just drove by while I was out picking up stuff and waved at me. He's like, yo, fellow. Garbage picker. <laughs> Anything there? Nope, that's all old carpets and junk. Sometimes you can tell just by looking at the pile, like, hey, there's not gonna be anything there. But then sometimes the good stuff might be covered up. So, who knows? Who knows? I'm pretty much driving through like our whole neighborhood. Snowman Christmas decorations. 
hard to see. Beautiful day to just drive around the neighborhood too, you know? I did notice quite a few other people out. Okay, I don't have my seatbelt on, don't judge me, but I am like driving around making frequent stops. So, and I'm in the 40 speed zone, so no judgment here. Okay, there's like this really like sketchy lady just like walking in the middle of the road. Don't think you can see her in my rear view, but like she's probably out looking at stuff like me, but she was just like standing there and then when I slowed down to look at this pile, she just like gave me a glare. So I'm like, you want something? Okay, I just drove by this lady like going in her trunk of her car and she's going through a bunch of garbage bags of clothes. So I'm guessing that she just picked them up from somewhere. So I'm like, what the heck? I wonder what she's gonna do with them if they're no good. I should like, Loki, hang out here and see what. Oh, she's tying one up. Let me see. I'm just gonna literally pull over and be a stalker. I'm gonna go pretend like I'm looking at this pile over here and then see what she's doing. See, there she is, like at her car down there. But I'm just gonna look through here to see if she puts them at the end of her driveway. All right, what do we got here? We got birdhouses. We got fake planters. Whatever this thing is. Furniture. I wonder how many trips the people are gonna have to make to get all this stuff, like just from everyone in general, because people threw out a whole bunch of stuff. Hmm. Look in here, just like, oh no, there's like a bunch of people outside over there. So I don't know if I'm gonna go over and creep her after, but you know what, maybe I will. Maybe I'll just stay in the car and wait looks like she put them all back in her car so I'm guessing that she's like taking them all so it looks like the lady just went back in her house and left the clothes in the trunk of her car maybe she didn't pick them up from the garbage pickup maybe she bought them somewhere but oh that's a shelf I wouldn't be able to fit that in my car I got distracted <laughs> so I just left I was like I'm not gonna stick around and be all stalkerish so onward I just found something I like to fit my car. It's a plant stand, but I see it's missing like the top and the bottom, so I think I'm gonna leave it actually. person had a bunch of cardboard so if there's any like full boxes I'd probably grab some but looks like a lot of it's broken up unfortunately I'm gonna check out this one too see if there's anything worth my while Looks like broken jewelry. Zara If I could find the pair of this shoe, I'd probably grab it, but I'm not about to go digging through all this stuff. It's like right on top somewhere. Oh. New with tags real fresh, I'll take that. Water shoe. I might grab that if I find a pair. Hmm. Oh, 
water shoe. You know what? I'm going to grab those. I think maybe Jesse might need a pair of water shoes. Grab those. Grab this necklace to put in my jewelry mystery boxes. And the joke fresh thing. What else do we got going on? Street or Society shirt. Sure. mostly what is this John Bone it looks like just a box to something that one shoe pair but like it could not even be in here and I'd just be wasting my time so that's how it goes Let's see if there's any more clothes or anything salvageable this is barbecue stuff yeah, maybe I'll grab that for our barbecue Paw Patrol stuff Ooh, it is getting hot out a real nice day today. Mm, yeah. No shoe. That sucks. What's this? Got a, got a few things. I saw this other pair of boots, thought I'd come check them out, but like most specifically, I really want this bag. Oh no, it's ripped. But like, honestly, I can probably sew it, so it's gonna get thrown out anyways. It's mine now. Let's see what we got here. Bunch of jars. Some mugs. Oh. Take that. Like, why throw this stuff out? Why not just donate it? That's what I don't understand. Any more mason jars? No, but I'll probably just grab. I saw these as I drove by, so I wanted to come just take a gander, see if there's anything. I think this is actually where I stopped the other day and I picked up a few shoes. So I've already been through this one. I'm gonna get a bunch of Tupperware and stuff. What caught my eye here was these this jewelry display Ooh, that I just broke. <laughs> what? Hmm. Might be able to find something to do with that. That's a pig! Mm -hmm. Bunch of random stuff. File folder. Picture frame. That's actually. Oh, I might get this. See if my friend wants this. Alenka. Alenka, you want this? <laughs> Um, what else, what else, what else? So that's that one. Looks like all kids stuff too. See now, if this lid had a bin, I would take it because that matches the bins that I have. But I don't see it here, so that sucks. But yep, grabbing this girl. Mm -hmm. Wow, a 
all these plants. Like, if this person's getting rid of these plants, you know what? I'm just gonna take them. So a lot of them are dead, but these three are alive still. So, are they coming home with me? Honestly, at this part, it's hard for me to tell if I've driven past the ha if I've driven past the same heap of stuff a million times, or if. Let me check this one out one second. Anyways, back to that thought. It's hard to tell if I've driven past the same heap a million times, or if it's like people just throwing out the same stuff. You know, oh, that's a big piece of live edge wood. I want to go look at that. It sucks because I can't like flip the video around like while I'm filming, so I have to start a whole new video. But like, look at this. Like this person could probably sell this for a good amount because live edge wood is fairly expensive. But like, it's heavy. I don't have anything to do with it. Oops. Fail. Didn't really see anything in particular here that I wanted to look at, but. I thought I'd just come out and see, just in case, you know. And nothing here. Okay, I think I'm actually remembering a lot of this stuff because I drove down here with Jesse the other day. And we didn't really stop unless he saw something that he wanted and I would jump out and bring it in the van. But, you know, we just drove around. People have been putting some new stuff out. Oh yeah, we looked at those lawn chairs, but they had like cigarette ashes and a bunch of dust in them. So. I don't know, there's a bunch of... I'm trying to decide how I look there. There's a bunch of shoes, but I don't think I'm going to pass. I have quite a bit of shoes. So. Let's see if I don't know. Good. I'm going to keep driving. So I've checked out the far side of town. I've checked out downtown. I've checked out kind of the suburb area. And now there's this one area that's kind of going on the way out of town that I want to check out. Don't think we've really looked through there yet. So, hopefully there might be some good stuff. Haven't found too, too much. A lot of stuff that I'm just going to be donating because like, it's perfectly good stuff that someone will find use for, you know? I'm kind of like looking as I go. There's a car behind me now, so I really can't like make any random stops. I don't think people would like that. I remember growing up when I was still in my parents' house, large article pickup was like a big thing for us. So, and my dad specifically, he would go around and find all kinds of treasures and whatnot. And now that I'm on my own, I have a house. It's nice that I can go out and do my own pickup stuff. See what's on this side of town. Every stop that I go to that I see tote lids, I always expect to see the totes, but they're never there. It sucks. Don't see there. More tote lids, of course. What is that? Is that a painting? Someone's art project. Lots of boxes and garbage. A lot of kids' toys too, honestly. That's what I'm seeing, like the bulk of like kids' car seats, large appliances, stuff that's hard to get rid of. And with that stuff, it's kind of hard. Like you don't know whether to pick it up or not, because like it might work, it might not, and you might just be picking yourself up a big load of junk. Speaking of a big load of junk, I'm gonna see if there's anything good in this pile here. See a dog statue. Hello. Um, oh, I see garden ornament. That might be kind of nice. Let me check it out. What is this? Is it a butterfly? Okay. Yeah, it's kind of cute. Same with this one. It's all 
while I'm grabbing. Okay, literally like a second after I picked up those lawn ornaments, I was like, these are like super rusty and no. So I just threw them back. So now I'm just waiting for this. I see what this truck's doing. But he's parking, so I'm gonna go look at this one more pile. Mm -hmm. I saw a purse, so I thought I'd pull over and check it out. It's nothing special, really. Leonard refrigerators. Oh, look, they have one of those milkshake makers. <laughs> Halloween costume. Ninja Turtle toy. Yeah, nothing here. Some cushions. Oh, that's kind of nice. Ooh, it's like velvet. Whoa. Shoe bottles. You know what? I'm gonna take that because I use those for shipping shoes. Um, umbrella. Don't know what that's for. Oh. Good thing I looked under here because there's another shoe box. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. No shoes in there, no. Just the boxes. Which is fine. And some garden lights. They're probably broken though. And nothing there. Cool. The murder house. Ooh. I'm gonna take that because if I don't read it, I'll donate it. There's a whole box of books. Interesting. Oh, here's some clothes. Mm. Nothing grabbing my eye there. Looks like actual garbage, so yeah, I'm just gonna take this. <laughs> Nothing there, really. See what I mean? The tote lids and no totes. Hello, tree. Um, yeah, nothing there. Just thought I'd look. So I drove like maybe two minutes out of town on this other road that I know. Just to see if there is anything else out here. Samsung Galaxy tablet. <laughs> Should have left the tablet in the box. Glasses, anyone? Nice pink feather duster. Yeah, maybe I'll throw these in the donation bin. Here's the thrift store. All these boots. I was wondering about them, but those are okay. I think I'll grab those. Okay. Big old pile of stuff here. 
Ew, that is soggy. What? Seriously? Anyone want a big bag of Halloween candy and chips? No thanks. Vaseline. Just the most random stuff, honestly. Yeah, I wanted to look at this planter thing, but it's plastic, so it's not gonna be very sturdy. Alright, so I'm just making my way back to the house now. Looking at stops on the way. This is Disney, you know? Might go for something on eBay. So yeah, I've been out for like, I don't even know how many hours. So. <laughs> Whoops. Some mugs. Ooh, Who's this? That is cute. Oh, it's a music box. What? It works. Hmm. It's a fake bell. It's got a chip in it. A couple of mugs, you know. I sell mugs on Poshmark. I've heard they do well on eBay as well. I just have not started that yet. But we shall see, we shall see. It's just a, there's some broken stuff in there, I think. And, yep. There, got a couple things from here. And this pile is just across the road, so I figured I'd take a gander as well. Oh, bought the shoes. Perfect. Basket. Oh boy. Yeah, these are all like people's winter boots that people don't want to deal with anymore. You know what? Uh, I would take this whole box, but I have room, so I'm going to get a bag. Well, I did have another bag in my car, but I can't find it right now, so I'm going to use my my new winter snow bag. Okay, so under armor. Kids shoes. This is gonna be too hard to do with one hand, so I'm gonna stop filming now. So I basically just grabbed the amount of shoes I would throw this bag. And while I was over there the one of the kids who lives at the house came out and was like she probably heard something and was like, who's there? looking pretty full. And my trunk's a jar again. Typical me, always forgetting. <laughs> I did notice quite a few people driving by and like giving me looks. Or just like maybe just looking at what I'm doing. See I get distracted quite easily while I'm, when I'm trying to film as well as looking at stuff because I'm like, ooh something shiny, what's that? <laughs> But like, this is normal for me to like dig through people's stuff. Like this is what I do at thrift stores. It's what I do at the bins. So like, this might be completely taboo to some people. But to me, I'm just like, hey, this is just like, it's my job, you know? Digging for treasure. Rid of a whole bunch of colored craft paper. So I'm gonna take this and use it for making my thank you notes. Oh, I'm getting a little thirsty. I think I'm gonna have some of my sunny D. Dude, it's so cold. What? Ooh, this looks like someone donated all of their Halloween costumes. And creepy dolls. Empty. Yeah. We always find ourselves collecting a lot of spray paint. La Senza girl. Ooh, take that. I think that's a tablecloth. Little purse. There's something inside it. What's inside of it? Some doll clothes. Throw that in the donation bag. This is for like, oh, it's for bath toys. 
that. More shoes. Nothing too fancy. So I just got a purple bike, and I think these are for going over the tires, so I'm going to grab those, see if Jesse can find something to do with that. Yeah, it's all from here. So, last week my grandma texted me saying she's looking for a bubble wrap to cover her pool, and she didn't want to go out and buy some. And, ironically enough, I just found this huge roll of it, and then I just got off the phone with her, and she's like, oh yes, please grab it for me. So, something for my grandma. And anything else while I'm here? Oh, there's a nice little pot. Grab that. Yeah. Bubble wrap. All right. Oh, maternity clothing. Hmm. That's kind of cute. I don't really want to grab the whole box this time. Mm. Actually, yeah, I'll grab it and then donate. Whoa! Pardon? Deck like for the garden? Yeah. Oh, is there some up there? Yeah, it's just something they have to look at. Maybe I'll go take a look. To your garden. I'm, I'm grabbing all kinds of stuff today. <laughs> yeah. I don't know if it's anything you want. It's those little round ones in here. Oh, you lift that because I Oh yeah. Oh, it's killing my dog. Oh, they're gone. Oh, someone grabbed them. Oh no, wait a minute. Where are they? Someone. Here. Oh yeah. These. Oh yes, that is really cute. I will grab that. Okay. Oh, that's the only one left. They yep. took the rest. Someone else got oh, them. Oh yeah, because this was a whole box full. Wow. Well, someone left this one. Yeah. Oh, okay. It's cute. There you go. Thanks so much. Oh, that's okay. <sighs> yep. Everyone's just looking to get rid of stuff. So I'm gonna. Oh, my shoebox is gonna fall. Whoops. Goodness. Okay, so for this box right here, I am definitely going to make a trip to the thrift store today. That's pretty. Thrift store or Poshmark. Gotta find a spot where it's not gonna fall and break. Just looking at these two. Cougar boots. Let's check them out. They're decent enough. Add them to the collection. Oh, my plants. I'm getting so carried away here. <laughs> but I'm glad I got the chance to document this. And just kids' shoes and stuff. Yeah, I think that's all from here that I'm gonna grab. Some more books. Do, 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 do. Backpack that's kind of dirty. Milk pitcher. Mm -hmm. I want to check this out because I thought these were closed, but they're not. It's a nice fake tree here if anyone wants it. I came over because I just wanted to see what this NASCAR thing was, and it's like a wall plaque. And then there's this plastic bag that I'm going to take. I can use it for shipping. Oven mitt. Oh, that's a bunch of utensils. And then there's like this vintage laundry bin. So it looks like the rest of my day is going to be going through, picking out the stuff to take to the thrift store, and then go and drop it off because I'm not going to keep all this stuff in my house. Okay, so that concludes my large article pickup haul. So I think I had a very successful day, as you can see the car and the front seat. So yeah, a lot of stuff I'm going to be bringing to the thrift store to donate because there's a lot of stuff that was like perfectly fine that people are just throwing out. If I had the time and the space, I would have picked up a lot more stuff to bring to the thrift store, but... I'm just trying to do my part to help out around here and I, I'm pretty happy with what I picked up and what I'm going to be saving from the landfill. So thanks so much for watching my video 
and I hope everyone has a great week and make sure to subscribe if you haven't already and also give me a thumbs up. Bye!